I like restoring. I like fixing things up. Houses, pottery. My grandfather was a painter. He was an academician, and that's how he made his living, and he did mostly landscapes and portraits. Professor Zambone from New York uh, University did all of the portraits. We have uh, 20 in the uh, lower uh, orchestra area, and up in the mezzanine we have another uh, nine on each side that makes it 18, total of uh, 38 portraits altogether. They're important because of the, uh, they're all, it has to do with music. Composers, conductors, performers. We have uh, Toscanini here, the conductor. We have composers from Chopin, Rossini, Verdi, Puccini, Litz, Wagner, and uh, Enrico Caruso is the performer. This goes up until 1926, okay. so uh, we don't have anybody represented after that because the theater was built in 26. We've identified practically everyone on the, uh, the first level. Uh, the second level we're still working on. This is Schumann. It's Schumann. I think. Wait a minute. Yes, it's Schumann. I think somebody at one point shellacked the portraits and that yellowed them and also many of them are very streaked. I'm trying not to change what's here. You know, what's underneath, I'm afraid of damaging what's underneath to the support. So I'll leave. I'll clean as much as I think I need to clean and leave the rest. I'm just trying to enhance the the tie here. Because I like John and I believe in what he's doing here at the Columbus Theater and it's nice to be part of it. A lot of people that are working here are working because the same reason I'm working here because they believe and they're happy to see the theater coming back after such a long time being closed. I've worked um, with other restorers, hmm. specifically a man who was the head of the Fog Museum in Boston, okay. Morton Bradley. He's now, he's not with us anymore, but um, I used to go up and work in, with him for a day on problem paintings. Sure, I, I, I love the, fixing things up. My wife and myself, we were both singers, and we were the New York City Opera. Uh, that's where, where we met and sang together, and uh, that was a number of years ago. <laughs> Everything has to do with performing and music, and that's what the whole theater is uh, uh, all designed for.